Let's make the pano look its best. We can do this by optimizing the pano. On the right hand side are tabs. The first tab is diagnosis, followed by findings, nerve, CAD cam, implant, surgery. For optimizing the pano, we're going to stay in diagnosis and select this mandible shaped icon. Left click on that one time. This opens up the new panorama window. You'll notice the default is the U-shape and the middle patients. I'm going to ask you to select the larger patients, which changes the panorama curve. Did you notice the change? I'll go back. Middle, large. This will fit 90% of your patients. Then I'm going to ask you to move the yellow line down to the mental foramen. Currently we see it here in the lower window and I want you to move it down to intersect with the mental foramen here. You can do this by using this down arrow. You can click through it slowly or hold it down and let go once it intersects. It'll intersect here and also intersect in the axial view. Once we're there and seen in both windows, left click, hold, and drag the panorama curve until the blue line is within the bone. You can change the thickness of this panorama curve here. My recommendation is leave it at the default 150 or 175. Once you get the pano looking the way you like it, select save, then OK. Now you're done optimizing the pano.